Hello again and welcome back to The Planning Professor. My name is Cynthia. I am going to experiment this time with an August monthly kit. Now I am really bad about not using my monthly pages. As you can see it is just blank as the day I purchased it. But what I'd like to do is maybe use this to track birthdays and any significant events that go on in August. I don't track my bills or my paychecks here because I do have an Erin Conran monthly deluxe planner that I use for that. But I would like to get some use out of this. And even though the mid-century circles pattern is really pretty, I've seen a lot of monthly kits and I purchased a few from Peaceful Mind Design. Uh, including the August kit, which I'm going to go ahead and just give a try to and see what happens. So here is the kit. It is very summery and tropical. It's got two big sheets of washi along with some event stickers. This is a sidebar cover along with some bill due notices, um, some order notices. Uh, this month looks like that's a cover for for the sidebar. Oh, there's three bill due notices. Some more event stickers, some little dots, paydays, and some flags. And then there are some full boxes and more event stickers. So this will not take very long, I don't think. I just want to see what, what I can do with it. I think it'll be kind of fun and it can't hurt, right? So let's actually start with the washi again because that is probably the most stressful part is getting this thing down. In this case, it covers a big sticker. Look at that first try. If you watch my weekly plan with me, you know what a big deal that is for me. Okay, now let's do the other side, which I hate to cover up my circles, but these chevrons and bananas and pineapple are super cute. So let's, let's see what we can do. These are matte stickers, by the way, and they are super pretty. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, let's not talk till we get this down. Hold, please. All right, it must not be straight because it just does not want to go on there. It's punishment for getting so excited about getting the other side down on the first try. I'm sure of it. Okay. Oh, there's a thingy there. Okay. There we go. Look at that. Ta-da! Okay, that's super cute. I'm not much of a tropical person, honestly, but I really like the way that looks. So I think I'm gonna try the sidebar next, which I'm pretty sure this goes at the top. Oh, let's find out. Yes. I guess it could go at the bottom if you wanted it to. Oh, look, this big. look at the size of that checklist. That makes me so happy. I do love long checklists. That looks really cute also. The name of this kit is Fruity, by the way, if this is something that you are looking to do with your planner. And I think I think I do want to put down some of these pretty boxes just to give a little another splash of color. So I'm gonna take this pretty blue one. And there are some days that are kind of significant for me this month, this week. Um, this will be the first day of our in-service. So it's my first contractually required day of the new fall 2017 semester. 
So let's put that down. And this is the anniversary of the day I first moved to my current state to take my job teaching English. Oh, and that's a little bit too big for the box. I'm gonna have to trim that just a little bit. it better. Oh, that's perfect. Look at me trimming things. Okay, that's really pretty. The first day with students this year is the 21st, so we'll put this down here. This is also the day of the solar eclipse for any of you who are astronomy nerds in your free time like I am, and I think that's going to be really, really pretty. Um, I guess I could have used these to block out the days that are not part of the month as well. Maybe that's what they were intended for. But I kind of like using them just to mark off days that are important. Otherwise, it's just, ugh. So, okay. So, and then this last one. Whoops. I have a really good friend's birthday. And I want to make sure actually Wednesday. Put that down and there we go. Now that is super cute and I have a bunch of event stickers that I can use as things come up. I guess I could mark my paydays, right? It wouldn't be the dumbest idea. Um, okay, well, I get paid every other Friday, so we will get me breaking my own rules. We'll mark this Friday, because it's the, this Friday is payday, and then again on the 25th, which is exciting. Okay, and then we're going to do date dots and call it done. So I will go ahead and put those down and I will be right back. Okay, so what you missed was me putting down the date dots, which are this pretty salmon color with white lettering, and I think that looks really, really pretty. I think I will put down some of these event stickers maybe at some point, but for right now, it's just a really fast, easy plan with me. The kits um, are very simple, but I think it looks really pretty, and these cover really well. They're matte stickers, but you cannot see the uh, the circles underneath, the mid-century circles, so it covered over really nicely, and I think the, the kit feels very summery and tropical, if that's something that you like and the, uh, the stickers feel just wonderful. So I hope you enjoyed this. I will link to Nikki's shop down below along with providing my referral link for Erin Condren if you are interested in purchasing this planner. This is an Erin Condren. This is a life planner, the vertical mid-century circles cover with a platinum coil. This is the neutral layout and this is what August looks like. So thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have questions or suggestions or comments, please leave them down below and I will see you next time. Bye.